Welcome to Pit Stop 2017. This is the third and final video designed to showcase several more new features included in this version, which is scheduled for release on April 20th. Visit www.enfocus.com for all of the upgrade offers which are available now until the software is released. Right away, you'll notice a new category within the InFocus Inspector, which is dedicated to transparencies and masks. The first section remains the same as earlier versions of Pit Stop and allows a user to change an object's opacity or blending mode. The next two sections work specifically with transparency groups and nested transparency groups. Within the third section, you can view the properties of transparency groups. Select a group and now toggle to the second option to make changes to the transparency group. Here, I've changed the blending color space to gray for an easy visual example. In the last section of the transparency category, you can now see a visual representation of how masks are composed. A great example of this is how a drop shadow is created from InDesign. Using the Edit Form tool, select the object and first take notice of the Luminosity Soft Mask. The four buttons below will show the following effects, but please note that these buttons do not change the content of a file. These options are for visual purposes only. Working from the right, this option shows you the actual mask used to build this drop shadow. Next, you can see the mask's overlay. The next button will simply disable the mask, showing only the object itself without a mask. And lastly, the first button shows the mask enabled. Thanks to the new GeoMapper technology, which can take into account underlying and overlapping objects, and was featured in our first Pit Stop 2017 video, we've included standard action lists to first, check for black text on dark backgrounds, and also to check for white text on light backgrounds. These action lists set the stage for users to customize new action lists for making similar types of checks. Device links are special color management profiles that are commonly used for ink saving, ink coverage reduction, converting colors between industry standards, and normalizing color separations. So typically, this lends itself to CMYK to CMYK conversions. PitStop has always supported device link conversions, but previously, users needed to create or purchase profiles. Through collaboration with our sister company, XWrite, PitStop 2017 will now ship with over 40 device link profiles. In our example file, after running a preflight to check ink coverage, you can see that our total area coverage is greatly exceeding a value of 260%. With the standard action list, device links, tack reduction, I'll select a reduction action that will convert this file from CMYK to CMYK using a device link profile, but now reducing the maximum total area coverage to 260%. Using the eyedropper, notice the difference between the original and adjusted files. More importantly, notice that no visual changes are detected, which will be a common thread for all device link conversions. A second example file shows what appears to be two duplicated images. But upon further inspection, notice that the separations are quite different, which could lead to some very challenging reproduction, to say the least. Using a device link conversion action list will again convert CMYK to CMYK, but now standardizing all separations while maintaining visual integrity. The final example shows a file originally built for Japanese output conditions, but will now need to be repurposed for reproduction in North America. For this, we'll be specific in choosing a device link conversion that reflects the original color intentions and the desired conversion destination, seen in the selected action list title. Not shown, we also ran a separate action list to also convert output intents to match the device link conversion profile. An additional benefit to device link conversions is that black objects remain untouched and not converted to a four-color black. 
This is due to a device link profile's ability to preserve primary colors, cyan, magenta, yellow, and black, and secondary colors, cyan and magenta, cyan and yellow, and magenta and yellow. Thanks for watching. This has been the last of three videos dedicated to the new features in Pitstop 2017.